100 jams where hit music lives. Locked in the midday chop up right here with your girl Erin Rain. Right now, the time is 11.30 and it's all about chat trap. Letting you know about all the hot topics that's happening in the media. Just that bougie bad ten in the mix with trust issues. Something I'm pretty sure a lot of us have at this point, I'm just saying. <laughs> but right now, of course, you know, chat trap is brought to you by Easy Payday Loans. And remember that you do not need luck when you've got easy payday loans. Their loans are simple, fast, and easy. We're talking about instant approval. Eligible applicants can borrow up to $15,000. So just call to begin your loan process today. That's 603-0200. Or visit them at their new location on University Drive. Right now, jumping into the hot topics in the media. Boy, oh boy. I don't know. This world is changing drastically. And in my opinion, the world has become much more sensitive to so many things. And everyone now today believes that their opinion matters all the time. Because so many books, so many brands, so many products have been canceled. And adding another one to the list. So, um... A theme ride, a theme park in California just recently opened up since they've been closed because of COVID-19. So the Disneyland theme park, they revamped the Snow White ride and it became the latest target of cancel culture because it features the iconic kiss by Prince Charming that happens as Snow White is asleep without her consent. Of course, you know, we thought this was so amazing. You know, when we were younger, we all, oh, we couldn't wait to see this part. But now they're saying that they did. It, it just doesn't need to be anymore. Like, he's no longer, they want this to show. And I'm like, come on, man. It's Snow White. It's the Prince. It's, you know, it, it, oh, gosh. I don't know. I just think everyone is just becoming so sensitive to certain things. And they're bringing up everything from back in the day, all your old childhood um, shows, childhood movies. And they're just trying to change things around entirely. And maybe it's because of the culture today and, you know, how things are just changing drastically. I don't know. Maybe that's what it is. But moving on to further news, letting you know what's happening with Mr. Drake. Certified lover boy is gearing up to release his album very, very soon. But it seems as though Drake is in the hot seat. And maybe this is how he got his certified lover boy name. Because a fiance of a female artist who Drake just recently signed took to social media blaming Drake for ending his eight-year relationship and their engagement. I'd say, first of all, as a man, to blame another man for the end of your relationship, uh, that's kind of weak. I'm just saying, it's kind of weird as well, but the guy actually explained that Drake had called his fiance to sign a record deal, and it flew both of them over, and then out of nowhere, all the trust was vanished with knives in his back and in his heart. Now, to me, I could be wrong, just my opinion on it. The guy just sounds really heartbroken about it, honestly, and he sounds like he really is just trying to capture the attention of the female that he was with. But neither Drake nor the singer um, that goes by the name Naomi Sharon had anything to say about this, and the singer only took to social media to explain that, yes, she's single, and from her choice of words, it comes off as if she was in a toxic relationship, in my opinion. But we all know when a woman exits quietly with little to nothing to say, then she is indeed truly done with the relationship. And I honestly think that's exactly what's going on here. And I think him taking to social media was just trying to get her attention in some form of way, seeing that he probably couldn't, might have, he might not have been able to reach her through text or through phone calls. You know, these guys do all these extra things sometimes just to get you to finally reach back out to them. So I'm pretty sure more of the story will definitely surface. So I'll keep you up to date with what's going on. But if you didn't know, it's Taurus season for all my Taurus celebrating their birthday out there. And today is Meek Mill's birthday. So happy birthday going out to Meek Mill. So that's it for Chat Trap. Letting you know what's going on, man. And Chat Trap is brought to you by Easy Payday Loans. Easy Payday is giving you low fees and the most competitive rates on any loan you apply for. That's instant loans, auto loans, loan consolidation, and quick financial assistance. So refer a friend and Easy Payday Loans will pay you. Easy Payday will give you $100 when you as an existing client refer a friend. Terms and conditions do apply. So call a visit today, 603-0200, or visit them at their new location on University Drive. Right now, I'm going to throw it back to Meek Mill, Future and Drake with Amen.